In this video, we'll discuss the pH scale. The pH scale is commonly used to represent solution acidity. The pH scale is a log scale based on 10, where P is the negative log. Thus, the pH is the negative log of the concentration of H+. This means that the pH decreases as the concentration of H plus increases. Let's discuss a neutral solution first. In a neutral solution, the concentration of H plus and OH minus are equal. Their product must be 1.0 times 10 raised to the minus 14. This means that the concentration of both H plus and OH minus must be 1.0 times 10 raised to the minus seven. If we focus only on the concentration of H+, plus, we'll see that the concentration is 1.0 times 10 raised to the minus 7. The pH is equal to the negative log of this concentration, and the pH is 7.00. This pH scale shows the concentration of H+, plus on the left, and the corresponding pH on the right. Starting at the top, an ammonia solution, for example, has an H plus concentration of around 10 to the minus 12, or 1.0 times 10 raised to the minus 12. The negative log of 1.0 times 10 to the minus 12 gives us a pH of 12.00. Any pH above the neutral pH of 7.00 is called a basic solution. Examples of basic solutions are strong hydroxide solutions, ammonia, and baking soda. Going down the scale represents increasing concentration of H plus and lower pH values. Solutions with pH values below the neutral pH of 7.00 are acidic. Examples of acidic solutions are coffee, vinegar, and stomach acid. The pH is a log scale based on the powers of 10. As you may have noticed, the pH changes by 1 for every power of 10 change in the concentration of H+. Log scales can also be applied to the concentrations of OH- to find the pOH, and to K values to find the pK values. Let's take a closer look at KW. Consider the equilibrium concentration for the dissociation of water. Taking the log of both sides gives this equation. By rule, the log of the concentration of H plus times the concentration of OH minus is broken up into the log of the concentration of H plus plus the log of the concentration of OH minus. Multiplying both sides by the negative sign gives this equation. Thus, the negative log of KW is called the PKW and the negative log of the concentration of H+, plus, as we've seen, is the pH, and the negative log of the concentration of OH- minus is the pOH. Since Kw is 1.0 times 10 to the minus 14, the pKw is the negative log of 1.0 times 10 to the minus 14. This equals 14.00. Thus, for any aqueous solution at 25 degrees Celsius, the pH plus the pOH must equal 14.00. pH meters are used to measure acidity. A pH meter is an electronic device with a probe that can be inserted into a solution of an unknown pH. The probe contains an acidic aqueous solution enclosed by a special glass membrane that permits migration of H plus ions. An electric potential results if the unknown solution has a different pH from the solution in the probe. This electric potential is converted to a digital readout and displayed 
as the pH. Let's review our equations. The Kw is the equilibrium expression for the auto-ionization of water and is equal to the concentration of H plus times the concentration of OH minus. This must equal 1.0 times 10 raised to the minus 14 at 25 degrees Celsius. We'll assume our solutions are at 25 degrees Celsius unless told otherwise. The pH is the negative log of the concentration of H. The pOH is the negative log of the concentration of OH minus. The pK is the negative log of the equilibrium constant. And finally, the pH plus the pOH for any solution at 25 degrees Celsius is 14.00.